earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. The Lord bless her and keep her. The Lord make his faith to shine upon her. Mark, I know you're hurting, but please don't shut me out like this. She's coming back. She's gonna come back. Two of them, so we could be brothers. Oh, well, as if one wasn't enough. <laughs> Mark, you'll understand, don't you? I'm leaving you now, so I... So I never have to leave you again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not so fast. How about some breakfast? Did you sleep okay last night? Yeah. Good times, good memories, good gracious what a day. Vultures, partaking in every artificial moment. Cancer. Who cares? You're gonna die anyway. Joey's in a jam. What should he do? Uh, Kate. Get a teacher. Excellent. Get out of there. You got it. Let's see if Joey's that smart. What now? You bought the cards, man. Junk. What'd your mom look like last time we saw her? Kind of pale. Kind of pale. I took a real good look when my kid brother Richard drowned in the bathtub. Your brother drowned? He was completely blue. You should have looked at her eyes and her lips. And touched her skin to see what it felt like. Boss. So you pull the cable back to here. Go ahead. Lock and load. Don't hit her. Just give her a scare. What a great shot! Yeah. But the sight's not right yet. <sighs> yeah. But the sight's not right yet. <laughs> It was fine. Tomorrow will be even better. <laughs> if I let you go, you think you could fly? <laughs> oh, you know, I spoke with Alice Davenport this morning. Oh, she's a therapist who works with Wallace. Right. At the <laughs> because when you make a promise. When something's your fault. What did you do? I let someone die. No! 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 Mark? Can't sleep? Helping your nephew deal with dead mother issues? At least you're wearing a robe from Sears, making boys think their mothers have come back from the dead every day. 
I know you miss her. Do not worry, Culkin. Their love will be their downfall. <laughs> Try to hit that sign. Negative. Targeting. I was only trying to scare him. Don't worry, Marv, I'll get him for you! A change, you filthy animal. Go ahead, tell him. Or better yet, why don't we tell him together? It was Mark, Dad. Chuck me into it. Dad, Mark's got something to tell you. What is it? What's wrong with Mark? I don't know. He's been acting pretty weird. I better go see if he's okay. <laughs> I told my dad I'd see if you're okay. Well. Are you okay, Mark? Guess what? Mom says we can go skating tomorrow. Connie, what did I tell you about coming into my room? You guys weren't working or anything. You didn't answer my question, so I'm going to have to do it for you. <laughs> You're not allowed to come into my room. Ow! Not now, not ever. Never. <laughs> You're wrong about that. This is my room, too. Mom, Mom, they're fighting. You like my sister, don't you? Such a <laughs> sweet little girl. Too bad if something were to happen to her. She got hurt. You'd be sad, wouldn't you, Mark? But hey, accidents will happen. Boys, boys, Henry! What's going on? I'm sorry, Mom. We were playing this really dumb game. We weren't fighting. We were just playing. Weren't we, Mark? Yeah, playing. Right, but just not so rough, okay? I mean, you two look like you were trying to kill each other. Did you really have to go out? Yeah, Mark, we've been planning this for weeks. You guys will have fun. Listen. Connie! Connie! Girls, thank the Lord you are well. And now go to sleep, said Miss Clavel. She chose a darling story, Mark. What are you doing? I want to talk to my kid sister. <laughs> Such a sweet little thing. Do you really think I'd hurt her? Yes. What do you think this is, a game? didn't just slip. You don't know what he is. 
Henry tried to kill Connie, and you could do it again. Oh, stop it! Stop it! That's a lie! Stop it! Stop it! That's a lie! Mark! Good. Hi, Mark. Holy hell! Everybody else. Mark! Wait! He scares me sometimes. What does he do? Please don't ask me that. I can't tell you. Why not? Because Mark's my friend. Please, Henry. Tell me everything. Everything? But I guess you wouldn't understand that. But it's true. She's my mother now. Hey, Mark. Don't fuck with me. Don't fuck with me. at your mom's funeral. He wouldn't. Wouldn't what? Hurt her. Your mom, my mom. What the hell? I'll kill you first. Poor Mark. So violent. Use your aggressive feelings, boy. Let the hate flow through you. Wallace! You will stay in here until you are ready to talk. <laughs> Uncle Wallace! You have to tell me the truth now. What happened the night Richard died? I was downstairs playing. Henry, don't lie to me. Now you tell me, did you kill Richard? What if I did? Henry. Henry, no. Henry! Ladies and gentlemen, our fugitive has been on the run for 90 minutes. What I want out of each and every one of you is a hard target search of every gas station, residence, warehouse, farmhouse, hen house, outhouse, or dog house in that area. Henry! I guess you don't know me very well, Mom. Doing some climbing, feeling the weight of the world on your shoulders, your own son tried to kill you as he's fighting your nephew, turning your perception of reality completely upside down? Pepperidge Farm, cause your life's really fucked up. Thank you.